hello guys welcome back to good share tips and in this video we're going to talk about how to fix spider-man remastered fix error this game required windows 10 version or 1909 or later and how we can fix this up so let's dive into the workarounds so uh, we have already uploaded many videos on our channel and also you can refer our website get your tips for the same which i'll be providing link in the description for many more fix okay so let's move to the workaround so the first one what you have to do is you just have to click on the file explorer now from here you just have to go to this pc over here you just have to click on local disk c from here you just have to scroll down and navigate to program file x86 open this from here you just have to scroll down and navigate to folder named steam from here you just have to scroll down and you have to find steam folder as you can see steam folder so you just have to select this right click and navigate to show more options and go to properties from here you will be getting an option called compatibility click on this one and if this will be ticked in most cases right so if it is ticked what do you have to do is you just have to uncheck it okay once it is unchecked you just have to go for apply and you have to go for ok once it is done you just have to close this and do a restart on a pc and most probably the issue regarding this will be completely fixed and even after trying this if it's still not working you don't have to worry we have parallel solution the next one is all about you have to update your windows on your pc or laptop if you are on windows 10 you have to update it to the latest version if it is available simultaneously if it's on windows 11 you just have to follow the instruction go over here and you have to search for settings now from here you just have to click on windows update and as you can see uh, this is the update and right now uh, here i had some error last time when i'm trying to update because of uh, i lost the power so i had an error so here you just have to go for retry so in your cases you will be getting update option okay you don't have to get panicked when you get an update option just go for update after updating you have to think i mean you have to wait and once update is successfully done you just have to close this and restart your pc and go back to the steam and try to play and most probably the issue regarding this will be completely fixed so these are the basic two steps sometimes by doing these steps this has to work sometimes it won't work so you don't have to panic we have a few more methods next one is all about you have to update your windows 10 or update your windows 11 using installation assistant so i'll be providing link in the description to both these for uh, the windows installation assistant for windows 10 as you can see windows installation assistant for windows 11 so those who are of the windows 10 users this will be available in the description both the link you don't have to worry you just have to click on this one the windows 10 users will be taken over here and from here you just have to download and you have to install it simultaneously for the windows 11 users you just have to open the link and you just have to download it and you have to install it once you're done with the install you have to restart the pc because sometimes after doing an update restarting pc is a lot of helpful and once it is done you just have to open your steam and try to launch the game and most probably the issue will be completely fixed even after trying this if it's still not working you don't have to worry we have few methods which is actually worked for many of the users and one among these three method is very important which i'll be naughty guys out so the next one is all about you have to verify integrity of game files we know that how to verify integrity of game files right so this is the library where you'll be having the game which you are having right now so as you can see i'll show you an example with forza horizon 5 because i couldn't purchase uh, this uh, spider-man remastered because i'm having some trouble with my credit card because my credit card is not uh, you know uh, visa it is mastercard so i'm not able to purchase it i did contacted the steam support they said i have to update my card when most probably i'll be able to do the purchase or else i'll not be able to do the purchases so i have just uh, you know done the necessary steps from the bank associates to do this so here i'll show you an example with the forza horizon 5 don't get confused many users keep commenting and saying you have you are not having the game or you are showing with the wrong game the process is same it's not about the game it's about the process so here you just have to right click and you just have to go to properties and from here you just have to click on local files and there is an option called verify integrity of game files so you just have to click on this one so what happens is if any files are corrupted by default this will be fixed 
So this is very important step and this has worked for many users and for many games sometimes because of some uh, corrupted files on a game when you are trying to launch the game you will be having some trouble. So one among the trouble is this one and the fix for this one is all about you have to verify integrity of game files. So uh, you just have to wait until it's get 100% it. so I will be skipping this part. So even after trying with verify integrity of game files if you are still not able to fix the next is all about you have to uninstall the game. You have to uninstall the game and you have to reinstall it back because sometimes a simple process reinstalling and not installing back this will work out so i suggest you guys you have to uninstall and reinstall and most probably the issue regarding this will be completely fixed even after trying with all these things you are still having a lot of trouble and you're not able to fix this issue up next is all about you have to update your graphic drivers manually so uh, you just have to go over here which i'll be providing link in the description so this link is for one is for nvidia another four is for amd mine is amd so i'll show you an example what you have to do with the geoforce nvidia so here this particular link which we i'll be giving in the description will take you to this and from here you have to down uh, update your give the respective details and update your uh, nvidia geforce simultaneously and you have to install it simultaneously if you are for the amd drivers you just have to do the necessary you just have to give the uh, details like this as you can see we are having graphics and here we have to select the which model okay so you have to uh, do the necessary for example if it is graphics you have to select the graphics and from here you have to select the model so here mine is i think it is uh, uh, the necessary you have to select and once it is selected I mean the model said you just have to go for RMD. For example, you have to uh, select this one also. So you have to select the respective and you just have to go for submit. So what happens is this will take you to another process. From here, you just have to download the thing like Windows 11, 64 bit, 10 bit. You know, it depends on the PC 86 and 64. So you just have to select the respective one and you have to download it. After downloading and installing this, you just have to go back and most probably after installing this, you just have to go for a, a restart also. After doing a restart and most probably the issue regarding this, I mean the error regarding game, uh, game repair Windows 10 version or 1909 or later will be completely fixed and you don't have to worry because this is quite common and these steps which i mentioned overall i mentioned around six step these six steps will be working and helping guys out you don't have to panic and also i request to follow the instructions very carefully and if you're not listening and you're not doing properly you will not be having the same result so i request follow the instructions very carefully and do the step and most probably after doing this the issue regarding this will be completely fixed and i hope this video is helpful and if you find this video helpful don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more notification see you soon in the next video and also regarding the link which i'll be providing in the description so you don't have to worry just click on the respective link and that will take you to this so see you soon in the next video bye bye